At the beginning of this week, I want to talk about working hard, how there are really in life no shortcuts, and that is good because we're here for soul growth. We're here to work hard. If you don't, you just stagnate and you rust. It is an absolute pleasure to do work that you love. I work harder in ministry now than I've ever worked. Put in longer hours, travel more, but it is an absolute joy. And it's such a joy, it's not work, it's, it's play. In Romans 12, verse 11, it says, Never be lazy, but work hard, and serve the Lord enthusiastically. The world often promises quick, instant gratification. For instance, get rich quick. You know, if you've attended any of my prosperity seminars, here's how they're different. It requires you really to do work. You can't go to any seminar and expect instant gratification. You have to have skin in the game. You have to be willing to change your consciousness. My seminars on prosperity require after the seminar a full 30 days of working, literally working, morning, noon, and night to change you so that you can have a permanent change. By the way, we're bringing our prosperity seminar to the Chicago area on April 14th, so be watching for that. How about the quick weight loss? Uh, lose weight. Uh, I watched an infomercial the other night, just saw it for a second, where it said that I could lose 15 pounds this week. <laughs> How? By cutting off my head? Whatever you want, they say you can have it right now. And yet, life's experiences and God's Word teach us that the best things in life usually require heaping helpings of both time and work. It's because you have to change you. You have to change your consciousness. You have to become a new woman or a new man to hold on to whatever it is. Otherwise, it will fall through your hands. Look at the people that have won the lottery. Study it. Over the past 100 years, going back to the Lux Soap Contest that they used to have on the radio, almost without exception, the people are in worse financial shape two years after they've won this great amount of money than before because they didn't have the consciousness to hold on to it. That's what you have to develop. So it has been said there are no shortcuts to anything worthwhile. So it's important to remember that hard work is a proven way to get ahead. But more than that, it's also part of God's plan. I told you a minute ago that I work hard in this ministry. I've actually done seminars where people would announce me and uh, would say something like, he's retired from this job when he had this big ministry. <laughs> and that's true in a way. I'm not in that church any longer. However, when I was in that church, I used to sit for hours every day with my feet up on the desk talking to people and just drinking a cup of coffee. Today, do yourself a big favor. Don't look for shortcuts. Be willing to put in the time and have skin in the game. Because even if there were any shortcuts, they're probably not worth taking. So don't expect easy solutions to life's big challenges because big rewards usually take lots of effort. But here's the thing. You're not doing it alone. God is with you, working through you, and that makes work play. Promises of instant gratification. Well, they abound. 
but the rewards of hard work with God are greater than any quick fix that the world offers on an infomercial. God bless you.